Hey guys, I'm trying to rush right now to get to Ashland. I just dropped off Isaac at work early, but now I'm running late for, there's a pride parade in Ashland and I wanted to go to that. And I'm running a little bit late because a weird scheduling, Isaac had work and he also had a meeting this morning and it just, everything was thrown off. And I'm just like, ah, I'm trying to rush over to Ashland and it's not that, easy i'm about to get on the freeway behind a smart car i've never seen a smart car on the freeway that i can think of and i'm a little worried right now are you gonna be able to do it can you do it buddy come on we can do this we're all in this together took ages but i finally found a parking spot and now it's 11 30 so now i have to walk over i'll make the most of it i was just stressing out about trying to find a place to park. It was crazy. This duck is very much like me. It's the only one here. It's so pretty here, I wanna live here. I waited until I was in a less chaotic place to start vlogging, cause it was like crazy traffic down there, but I'm leaving now. I'm really disappointed. Obviously you guys didn't see any footage of the parade. By the time I walked back, there was no parade anymore. I missed it all. Which sucks, sis, because that's the main reason I went. But then the other thing is they had booths and stuff like that, but Everything was so spread out. It wasn't like one area with all the stuff. It was just like spread out and I didn't know where to go. They didn't, they needed some kind of like signs like, or a map like, hey, there's stuff over here and over here. But instead I was just kind of wandering around like where, where there's some stuff here. I think there's stuff that way, I'm not sure. And it was kind of stressful. I mean, I was already disappointed that I missed the parade. So I was like, not having it. Look it, it's autumn and look at the leaves. Ah! It's so cool, la la la. But now I'm really hungry and I need food. I'm kind of thinking of getting a pumpkin to decorate, like paint or something. Not carve, because that's messy. But to paint. It might make me happier. I don't know. We'll see about that. In the meantime, I'm just going to go around and do my normal store browsing that I do for some reason. I really want coffee right now, please. Can I have you? No! <laughs> hey, do you guys remember that time that uh, this young guy tried to charge me like 80 bucks for some pumpkins or something like that? <laughs> still don't know how that happened and I still don't know why he didn't think anything of it, but I was just like, I thought I was going crazy. So I didn't say anything other than, oh, you know what? Um, never mind, I'll get these another time. Because I just saw, I was just like, wait, why isn't he questioning it? You know, it was it was just a weird thing, and then I felt really weird afterward. Like, are pumpkins gold now? What is going on? Even though I was starving, I'm regretting my decision to eat Taco Bell. I only had a little gordita, but I feel like blech now. Ugh. Why? Why do I always have to pee? Whew. It's getting so cold now because it's been raining. Why is it taking so long? It's been raining. I am so cold that luckily I'm wearing a thicker bra today because otherwise my chest eyes would be staring all day. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, I um I commented on Instagram of like the real person that catfish person was taking pictures and information from. And they actually like took a screen cap of the page that this person, this other person made and was like, what the heck? And I was just kind of like letting them know what happened. They're a little freaked out by it. I mean, I would I would be a little annoyed, especially if <laughs> somebody stole your po photos and part of your identity. But I, I was kind of curious about the real person to see how much of the info matched up. Turned out they're a year younger than the person said they were. And they're originally from Ohio when the other person said Oakland, California. And there were some other things, and it's just like...
but on the other hand, they tried to match up other details of the life. I'm just really confused about why somebody would do that, but I'll stop talking about it. Lemon is obsessed with my newer shoes, the ones with the skulls on them, and she's just been hanging around them a ton, and no mine, but she was trying to attack them earlier. You better not freaking attack my shoes again. I want to go back out now though, but it's just pouring and I don't want to go in the rain. But it's cold in here. Oh my god. Why do you love shoes so much? Hey. Lemon. Hey. Stop it. Oh my god. Lemon. By the way, before you say anything, I am not superstitious. I will walk under all of the freaking ladders. I will spill salt. What? I'll break mirrors. I'll let a black cat cross my path. And it won't bother me because I'm not superstitious. I'm not religious. I'm not anything. I'm just kidding. That's not true. You can be quiet, okay? I'll be back in a while. You'll survive. Look at how cute these are. I do a lot of things that kind of make me seem like a jerk, but here's one thing. I don't like it when you're in a parking lot that has plenty of parking spaces and someone sees you go to your car, so they wait for your parking spot specifically. So if I see somebody waiting for my spot in a parking lot that has tons of other places to park, I will actually sit in my car and pretend to talk on the phone or something until the traffic backs up behind them enough to make them park somewhere else. Because there's absolutely no point. I understand if it's a really full parking lot, then in that case, like, I'd understand and want to move quickly so they can get the spot. But it just doesn't make any sense and I see it so often when- why- these- both of these people tried going on- why- stop trying to go on red! See how it's their turn now? Stop trying to go. There's this gun place called Guns R Us and it really just shows how much some Americans think that guns are toys. I mean, how many people do I know that give guns to their kids and... Oh! And there's no arguing against it or you're an American. Yeah, America, the land of the free unless you want to kind of question things. You're not free to do that. You're told to leave the country. But then again, if somebody was questioning where they're from, and liked America, Americans would say, no, you have to stay where you're from. You cannot come in here because uh, this is our place. Sorry, I just got a little political there. I will stop now. Yeah. I picked up a few silly Halloween decorations at the dollar store and I'm trying to just make it feel a little more Halloweeny because I love Halloweeny. This they call creepy cloth and I'm sticking like all these little, I got these things that I can do something with. I don't know. And I have no idea what I'm doing. And by the way, I never got a pumpkin. I was going to, but all of them were so big. And I was like, I don't really want the one that big. I just wanted a tiny little pumpkin to paint. <laughs> What the fuck? I'm recording? Oh.